In this video, I'm going to show you how to update your graphics card driver. So where do you find your graphics card driver? So you go to start, click on start, go up here to computer, right click computer and click manage. User account control will ask you, do you want the following program to make changes to your computer? Click yes. And this guy will open up computer management utility so down here you'll see device manager click on device manager and you're looking for what we're looking for is the graphics card driver it's always under display adapters so click on the arrow there and you'll see nvidia geforce gt 630 so double click on that guy and then go to the second tab which is driver and you'll see NVIDIA, the driver date, which is up to date on this one, and the version here. This version, the driver version here, is going to be different than what's on the NVIDIA GeForce NVIDIA, NVIDIA um, website. So we need to find the correct driver number. And the only way to do that is to go into your control panel for NVIDIA. So we're going to click OK there, minimize that, and right click anywhere on your desktop, and you'll see NVIDIA Control Panel. Click on it there, and NVIDIA Control will open. Now if you click on the Help tab here, you'll see you can update your driver by clicking on Updates. So click on Updates there, and it'll tell you the driver version that you have. And you can go and check for updates by, to, by going through this guy here. Check for updates. Click on that guy. Checking for new updates. No updates are available. So I came back with no updates available. So that goes out onto the NVIDIA website and goes into the server and checks for updates that relate to this driver here. Okay, so I'm now going to show you how to download the graphics card driver. Just in case you don't have this option in, in your um, graphics card control panel. So basically what you need to do is you need first the system information for the graphics card. So this is the number we're looking for here. 314.22 so that's the driver version that you'll get on the NVIDIA website for GeForce GT 630 graphics card okay so we're going to go to our web browser and we're using Mozilla Firefox here so just type in NVIDIA and then type drivers that's the first one there click on that guy and then you'll see driver download nvidia drivers and it's the nvidia.com drivers and it's united states so nvidia.com drivers and this is for yeah, worldwide for the drivers so it comes up with this page here download drivers so the first thing you need is the the product type and we know it's GeForce because we've checked it in here. GeForce GT 630. So we're on the website, that's GeForce, and the product series is the 600 series. You can go back and check. 600 series, yes. And if it was the 700 series or the 500 series, the 400 series, whichever series that you are, you can select it there. And then we need the actual product itself, the driver itself. So this one is a GT630. GT630. And then you have to type, you have to put in, you have to select your um, operating system. 
so it's Windows 7 64 for this computer yours could be Windows 8 or Windows Vista and it's be 64 bit or 32 bit and English or whatever language you are yourself and then click search and it'll go and search the so there's the new version of it release date operating system Windows 7 34 language English and file size is 169 megabytes so all you do then is you click on the download button here agree and download click this guy here and then you get this little box opening up just make sure it's the correct one Windows 8 Windows 7 yes we're Windows 7 so click save file and that will start download now depending on your internet connection make sure you're you're connected to the internet when you go searching for these or you won't even be able to get into the website so it can take a while depending on the speed of your your um, broadband your internet connection so we have already downloaded it so we're going to stop this one here and what we're going to do is we'll find that file so this is it here so I'm going to open containing folder and we're going to copy it it opens the containing folder and highlights the actual file that we're looking for you can see it there okay so right click and go copy and then you just paste it on somewhere in your desktop so you can have it handy and so we we'll close all these right click and paste right this is coming up because we've it already copied to the board so you copy and paste and then it comes up like that and then you run the file so basically all you do with these um, graphics care drivers once you have them on your desktop is double click on it and it will start the run now I'm going to show you how to install the graphics care driver so we extracted it here to the desktop I copied it to the desktop from the download folder so again NVIDIA wants to make a change through the user account so I click yes this is display driver Windows 8 Windows Vista Windows 7 64 and it's English so click OK and then it'll start extracting and this will also need a, a reboot of your system and probably ask you at the end so NVIDIA graphics driver is opening up there so this is the license agreement you can read it if you like just click agree and continue express recommended upgrades existing drivers and retains current NVIDIA settings so click next custom if you want you're better off doing the recommended um, option click next and then it'll install removing the old version and installing the new version again be patient here it takes a while for it to install Your screen will go blank a couple of times all expected you'll see other windows opening up too you can't see them on this recording it's up in the top left corner so you can't see that it just flashes very quickly a small little window again as I said it's all expected now so the f install has finished 
So it's now asking you to restart your computer. So restart your computer, or you can click restart later if you were doing something, but you're better off making sure that it's restarted and you see that it's working properly. Okay, so click restart and then your computer will turn off and shut and uh, boot up again. Okay. So system has rebooted there after installing the graphics card driver. So now we're just going to go and check, make sure that it's correct, correctly installed and all that. And manage, click yes to the user account control and then going to device manager and then going under display adapters double click on the GeForce and we see what driver is there now so now driver date and that is the new driver it's now 2013 it was 2012 so that's fine and general uh, this device is working properly so we're good to go so that's how you download and update your graphics card driver.